Hello and welcome to the show. My name is Alex and this is Tech Flow. A few weeks ago, we did a Tech Flow Top 5 for Father's Day, and in that video, we included the Yi Home security camera. So many of you were interested on the price and availability of that camera, and you said, could you compare it to the leading market mini security camera, the Logi Circle? We've done just that here at Tech Flow. Let's do this. So first off, let's go over the aesthetics and the looks of each camera. Now, as soon as any tech reviewer says that, I'm like, hmm, wait a minute. Just show them video and pictures of it and let you guys decide by yourself. My decision shouldn't influence yours. You see what one you would like to put in your office or your home. Personally, I think the Logi Circle looks nicer, it's a bit more sleek, and it looks modern. Where the Yi Home's a bit bigger, a bit more plasticky, and a bit bulky. But you guys can make your own decision on that. Now, with the Yi Home security camera being less than half the price of the Logi Circle, let's compare it and see what you're getting for each one. Now, each camera sports 1080p video. And this is a clip of the video viewing on my iPhone 6S Plus. You guys can view the playback quality for yourselves. But in my opinion, they're pretty much identical. With the Yi Home security camera having a bit less of a bit rate than the Logi Circle and it is noticeable. Now both the cameras have a cloud recording capability so as soon as motion is detected they will trigger the recording, send the recording straight up to the cloud for you to view later or live on your mobile device. Now personally I prefer the interface on the Logi Circle. It's really easy to navigate, you can just slide up and see all the times where motion has been triggered and it will start instantly playing the recorded motion. Now there's even a really cool feature on the Logi Circle which is a little bit of a niche but it's also really cool. You can time lapse the whole entire day. Pretty much it's called Generate Day View and you slide down to it, it'll generate it for a little second and then you can watch the whole day, all the motion in your house or office in a time lapse. Now the Logi Circle provides you with a full minute and a half around of clip when it detects motion where the Yi Home Security Camera gives you about five seconds. Which I suppose both is going to be able to tell you if someone's there or not, but peace of mind knowing with the Logi Circle, you're going to get a longer recording time, which is really cool. Bear in mind, both these cameras offer free cloud one day backup recording, which is really cool. Both cameras support live talk feedback, so you can hear what people are saying near your camera on your mobile device, and you can also speak back to the camera, so your voice will come out the camera. Here's the audio quality on the Yi Home Security Camera. And here's the audio quality on the Logi Circle camera. This is the Logi Circle testing one, two, three. Both pretty clear in my opinion. Other than that, I've never really had any issues with the Logi Circle. It's always worked and worked well when it's been connected to Wi-Fi. Both the cameras notify you on iOS anyway when motion is detected, so you can log on straight away and have a look. If you know no one's meant to be in your house or office, you can log on straight away, see what's going on. Uh, the Logi Circle also tells you if it's been disconnected, which is really cool. So if you think, hmm, my Logi Circle's been disconnected, I wonder why. Just sparks a bit of an idea in your head where the Yi Home Security Camera doesn't tell you things like that. And there's been numerous times where I've tried to log on to the Yi Home Security Camera and the app hasn't been able to connect to the camera. It's tried to load and it just hasn't worked, which is really annoying. And I can't tell if it's my internet that's down or the camera that's just not working. And I'm assuming it's the camera that's not working because we've got a lease line here at the office. And that should be up pretty much 99.9% .9 of the time. Now this might be a deal breaker for you. With the Logi Circle, it actually has an inbuilt battery. So it has this really cool little charging ring, which it sits on and that powers it if you want it wired. But if you want to move the camera for a short period of time, you can lift it off that charging ring, take it wherever you want for about an hour while it carries on operating through its battery. And I've used this numerous times. I have a little brother and when he's going to bed, I can put the camera in his room, check when he's asleep. And as soon as he's asleep, I can go and take his iPad uh, or his books that he's reading or his homework away from him um, and make sure all the lights are off and stuff. Really cool feature. And then you go and place it back on its charging cradle for normal use. 
Whereas with the U-Home security camera, you're always tethered to a micro USB cable. But I have tested this and it does work. You can connect the U-Home security camera to a portable battery backup. And I've had it running for 24 hours once on a uh, 20,000 milliamp battery backup. So if you do really want to use the U-Home's camera with a backup battery, you can. But it's not built in, is all I'll say. Personally, I prefer the Logi Circle. But then again, it's twice the price of the U-Home cam. So if you're looking for reliability, Logi Circle will always have your back. But if you just want a cheap camera to tell you if there's motion detected and that's pretty much it, go for the U-Home security camera. That would be my verdict. If you want a proper security system, Logi Circle, if you're wanting it to just check on the house now and again and have the odd security update, Yee Home Security Camera. That's my verdict. So that's going to be it for this review. The thing is with these cameras, the quality is good on both of them, a bit better on the larger circle, but the larger circle is twice as much. It's weird. It's a weird comparison just because of the price difference. One of them's budget and one of them isn't, and one of them's better and one of them isn't. It just depends on what, what, what you want to do with it. If you're being serious about security, get the Logi Circle, and if you just want it for home, just to see if the kids are back, or yada yada yada, get the Yee Home. My name's Alex, you guys have been awesome, stay awesome, keep smiling, this has been TechFlow, and we'll catch you in the next one.